let us fire up some good old Horizon Zero Dawn for this fine Friday evening. I sure know. I want to find out what the heck is going on. See if we can get some more of this quest done and find out more on this world. Figure out what's up with that corruption and why that merchant didn't warn us and just kind of fucked off. I also have a better bow and arrow this time around. And I didn't even have to use duct tape to keep it on me. I used, I, I, I used, like, adhesive tape thing this time. It's, uh, it's, uh, not as much, uh, pain when pulling it off. You know, last time, you know, I got stuck to my feathers. You know, it wrapped up in my little, uh, little chain thing from my earpiece to my neck piece. It was, it was a disaster. It, it took me forever to untangle that stupid bow. So, uh, in the end, I, I had to, I had to cut it up and use it for firewood. Uh, but this one, much better, much higher quality and better attachment adhesive. It just slips right off just a little bit of water and alcohol. You know, very easy, simple to use. Oh man, and uh, starting the game always seems to take forever in Horizon Zero Dawn. Kind of a, uh, at least it doesn't have frequent loading screens, so I guess I can't complain too bad. It's just the first load. Hmm. Oh, and I have a nice big old pot of coffee to go with this, so I am hoping we can make a good progress. Um, yep, alright, see X, right click. Sorry, Snuffy, but I need your delicious meat. Bony meat. Mm. Yum, 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 yum. Oh my... Immortal geese? Oh, oh, that's horrifying. Let's get away from that. Just be patient, and everyone will get in. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, it's just a merchant. Um, I need better weapons. Actually, that's <laughs> excuse me. This is a good find. Um, why can't I scroll? Let me scroll the Oh, I have to actually select weapons. Snarf. Shadow Battler. Close range bolt gun. Oh, it's basically a shotgun. For a second there, it kind of looked like an uh what is it? An acoddle? That kind it's a it's a it's a sort of a an enhanced um spear throwing where they kinda you slot the spear in against a against a stop, and you can just kind of chuck it, and it, it allows you to transfer more of your um, throwing momentum into a javelin. Um, it's a it's a super sick uh, super sick weapon. Shadow Shark. Okay, so I would like to get some of these. I probably should invest in a sling. So it looks like they use bombs. That would be kind of cool. I think I can afford at least two purple bows, and they are going to be a significant increase in our ability. You know, three mod slots, much better than one, and the handling, I think my current one has a handling of like 25 naturally, so, nice. 
So I think Shadow Hunter Bow is equivalent to our current mainstay, because I see it has the the sharp edge and the flame. But this war bow has a couple other Oh, this one it looks like it's specifically for certain status effects. So I don't have electricity yet. This is probably frost. This is probably um these are robots, so it's probably actually like acid. Shield break? Or armor break? I don't know what this scrap modifier is. It is serrated though, so I wonder I wonder if this is armor penetration and this is so like I remember the the crab unit throws up that uh, force shield that I can't shoot through. I wonder if this can somehow break through it because it does have like yeah this this is massive armor penetration ability but like no raw damage ability. Hmm. 800. I think I can actually afford... Oh, that's the shotgun. I don't have a trampler heart, so that's the thing. Watch your heart, sod your heart. Okay, so I think we'll get this to replace our normal bow. This is a straight upgrade. And then we'll take the sharp shot as well. And we'll put that... Wait, hold on. Are both of those sharp shots different? I need to... I need to get... How do I... I can... Stay alert. That's what I say. Um, enter. Uh, we'll deal with skills in a second. Hold on a second. Oh, oh, okay, so we don't need this equipped anymore. Hunter bow, normal, and fire. Normal, fire, and heavy. Okay. okay, so we don't even need that as well. Thing is, is can I remove the modifications? Modify weapons. Tinker skill not learned. Ah, uh, okay. Um, where is Tinker? Double shot, double shot. Do, 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 do. Over here. No? No. Removed and reused. Hmm. You know what? I think I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go up to Tinker. As soon as I level up. Um I don't know if I have any I don't have a lot of mods. Also Hello one shot. Welcome on in. Hope you have had a great week. I know I am certainly looking forward to the upcoming holidays. This is my bread and butter, so I do kind of want to put increased handling and damage. Hair and fire. We'll just kind of fill this out because why the heck not. I am doing pretty fantastic. 
This is Horizon Zero Dawn. It's, uh, I don't know too much about it. There's robot dinosaurs, though. It appears the setting is something like 50-ish years into the future. Um, it's a little bit unclear what's happened because um, there's a kind of techno-primitivism going on. Sort of a fusion between robots and, or sort of like mechanical stuff, but also still like wood and strings. We are finally able to, How long do we have to wait here? progress the main story. Basically, there is this merchant. Uh, we have this like little Dorito thing in our ear that's letting us interface with machines. And we noticed this merchant also had one that was kind of glitchy and outdated. And uh, our dad died. Talked to the night before the proving. Aaron said he'd introduce me to his sister if I visited Meridian. Said she was captain of the vanguard. And uh, our dad died because of some guy's raiding. And uh, he hit the bricks all of a sudden. And uh, we want to put him to the thumbscrews, metaphorically. But uh, what, was the, what was the game you were thinking of? Stop right there. In light of the recent attack, no stranger passes into Meridian without submitting to search. Recent attack? What are you talking about? The murder of Captain Ursa and her vanguards, of course. Ambushed by Shadow Carja forces in Redridge Pass. Ursa? You mean Erend's sister is dead? How would you know his name? I know Erend. Summon him. I need uh, to speak to Yeah, you mentioned... Ha. Huh. I doubt that Eren, the new Set captain a... of the Vanguard, a man in grief, is going to waste his time game on a primary outlander. Yeah, hey, Lloyd. We'll... Hey, you're alive. I thought you were dead. Make way, make way. All the way to Meridian, just to see me? Have you been drinking? Ah, not really. A little. So, you're alive. This, uh, we should celebrate. The drink's on me. We need to talk. Isn't alone, that the one that together. just came out? Over there. So you approve? Of course I approve. From now on, she may come and go from this city as she pleases. As you wish, sir. I know I've, I've seen most there. of the alone as you first act. one. And what did you um, want to tell me? So I probably, yeah, I probably won't um, play it. I, I don't know about the sir. sequel, though. I've I'm been sorry. avoiding... I know she was special to you. Seeing anything special about it because I'm, I'm it's one of those things that's special on my everyone. list of maybe she to play because I do uh bust everyone around. I do love me life. some Norse mythology and I think now the I'm uh supposed to fill her shoes. And instead here I am. The God of War series has certainly around. pivoted in in an interesting direction compared to the original games. I uh You know, the original God of War, they were very very hack and slash, very lots of blood, gore, murder, destruction, um, lots of ultra masculinity kind of stuff. But then the, everyone else tells you the worst thing that ever happened. That new God of War so makes it easier. And Kratos is much more humble. There was something you wanted to tell me. He's had a child. He had a wife, and it's it's really interesting. And I do, I do kind of want because I didn't again because I watched, I watched basically some people play through play through that game all the way through, so it wouldn't really be a fresh playthrough for I'm me. Um, I know she was special to you. Special I do kind of want to play Ragnarok. <laughs> special to everyone. But uh, I do have she a lot of other stuff. Bust everyone and around. And it's close to the holiday she season, in line. so I'm probably gonna I'm see if to it goes on holiday sale. And instead, here I am, stumbling around. In Fresh new games are way damn expensive. A lot has happened since we last spoke. The Proving was attacked by a group of killers. Not many of us survived. We were in the village when we heard explosions up on the mountain. 
As some of your braves came back, said most of the contestants were dead. I've never heard such a wail of grief as the sound that rose up from your people. How did you survive? How I survived is less important than how I was targeted. Targeted? What do you mean? The killers came for me because of Owen. What are you talking about? That doesn't make sense. I need to find Owen. I need to know what he knows. But he's a friend. No, no problem. He's a traitor. Thanks for stopping on by. The are and if you come want, on back, no, I'll know see you then. Owen is working with them. But I mean, this. I don't need you to understand, Aaron. I just need you to take me to him. He's not here. He went scrounging for scrap and relics days ago. It could be anywhere. Are there any places he frequents? Places he returns to? A house. Here in Meridian. Okay, then take me there. I need to search it. I guess. As long as I'm there to witness the search. I need to see Olin's place. Now. Okay, okay. Come on. Don't let your guard down. We gotta find we gotta find some blackmail material on Olin. Where's his where's his nudie cave drawings? So many people here all talking at once. How does anyone think? I don't. I just drink. Give me heavy faux she... faux Roman vibes from their guard attire. The Lady. Okay. Damn it, they're immortal. Okay. Year after year, why does he spare those who enslaved and tortured and butchered? Aaron, you should want vengeance more than anyone. Your own sister, murdered, and her death, unavenged? One more word, you scorched out slag, and I'll throw you in jail myself. Now get out of here, or I'll give you all a kick in the ass. All right, don't talk about his uh, dead sister, yeesh. Not now. Strolling along the vistas, listening to street songs. Come on, get to the bloody house. Yeah, yeah, we know someone's riling up people, they want to fight. Okay, how are we gonna get in? <laughs> oh, that was subtle. Here we are. Try not to break anything. That other than the door. All of this. Damn, he's got a nice Based little there. house here. Wow. Wow. Interesting. So they're painting on fabric. That's a that's a pretty nice little canvas painting. Also, ochre and insect derived pigments. That's um I think Egyptian paintings tended to use I think Egyptian paintings had a lot of insects. I wanna say European old paint pigments were more stone based, stone and plant based. I'm not, I'm not, a, I'm not a super good artist, so I'm definitely uh, not your person for art history. But I do know pigments um, throughout the ages have had some interesting areas they were derived from. And sometimes very uh, not good for your health stuff uh, for pigments. <clears throat> okay, what's going on here? Can I open this door? Nope. Guess not. Can I interact? Nope. Guess not. Miss something? 
Nope. That's a rock. That's another rock. Hey, Boxed! It's you! How you doing? I throw a rock, I pick up a rock, it's just rocks. All the way down. Ooh. Traditional painting? Like a you got a you got a physical canvas or you got uh you mucking with some digital digital painting. Let me just Can I grab that? It's killing me here. Ooh, painting minis. Tabletop RPG or some Warham? Yeah, yeah, they uh, they call I hear they call it Warhammer 40k because uh, 40k is how much you're gonna drop on building a, a sufficiently large army. <laughs> this is killing me. It's telling me to scan, but there's like only one thing to scan. It's always kind of a Eldar or a Tyranid player myself. Eldar to start with, but then I started gravitating more towards Tyranid because uh, uh, Carnifexes were just way too much fun to to build and customize. I swear, it's gonna be something to do with this mechanism. Throw a rock at it. Oh. Let me just tank my bloody health some more. I need to ask you something. This is your show. You said Olin has connections in the royal court. Does he know the Sun King personally? No. He served the court as a scout sometimes and sold ancient trinkets to nobles, but he never had an audience with the king. If you're right and Olin's into something dark, Sun King Avad has nothing to do with it. I'd stake my going life. Going for a a standard standard paint, or you got a you got a custom palette in mind for your army? Did Olin ever invite you in? Nah. Closest I got was a doorstep to help him home after a night out. We drank a river that night, but I hold it well. Y usually. Are you sure you're okay? I'm sober enough, all right? I don't need another lecture. That's not what I meant. I was talking about what happened outside with the crowd. I don't want to talk about that. We're here because of what you said about Olin, so do what you need to do. I'll look around. That's what we came for. You were not helpful. Oh, My there's another. Floor near it is warm. Let's see what's underneath. Hey, how did that get here? Question is, how to get through it? Without a key, All right. you won't. That's a vault or possible. secret Nothing BDSM dungeon. We'll see about that. Let's see, hold on. How do I? Figure that out later. Call it a day, girl. You're wasting time. Oh man, I I am a sucker for cyberpunk. Metal here. Could be just what I need. You can't forget the uh, the cyan as well. 
usually see that like light blue and that light purple pink kind of colors together. It looks big and heavy. Let's give it a little push. I do kind of wish I could I could do a uh, you know that cyberpunk undercut on one side and then either like a, a mohawk or a side over kind of hairstyle. But uh, Barber Barber really mucked up my hair. Break anything, didn't I? And I'm trying to figure out what the hell to do with it ever since. I'd uh, let my hair grow out for uh, about two years and change. And I was like, alright, this is getting a little too long. Let's, uh, let's, go, let's shorten this a bit. And they uh, basically buzzed off to a one, like, all the way around except for the very top. Um... Which is not what I was telling them and asking for. Uh, I don't know. It was pretty awful. I feel the the Eldar. I kind of want to say like the Prism Cannon could be really cool to go ham with neon colors. Um. And also, maybe the Tau could look interesting with a Cyberpunk palette. It's been a while since I've seen the Eldar minis. Um, so nothing's really jumping to mind other than other than those as far as what might look cool with that palette. Serve and they live. Disobey and I will open their throats and leave their corpses to prune in the sun. Yeah, that's true. Child captive. I keep forgetting they? that there was a. Who's they? The killers. They told him to obey. How? Point of view Warhammer 40k game. This I think it's called what Firewatch. Something about it. Like I just always yeah. forget that it's in the Warhammer 40k the verse. Places he visited. Ah yes, the map. It's, it's a map, all right. Yeah, it's a uh, that's an old game, all right. Looks like Olin kept a journal. Olin? I knew he could read contracts, but I never took him for a poet. No doubt now. Olin knew I was targeted. View the notebook. Yeah, yeah, I think it was... It, it, yeah, it was more of a, this is a first-person shooter rather than this is a Warhammer 40k game. Let's see, fourth day turns traitor. Six, eleven days. Thirty days. Device calls me in secret to the new dig site. Alright, so I think they are communicating with him via his stale Dorito. Unearthing ancient weapons. Interesting. Okay, so he's been he's been a traitor for a while. Um, almost two months. Because fifty fourth, that's when uh, father died, and that's also his last entry. So it looks like they're going to Rock Reef, wherever that is. There's your proof. Read the last page. He writes about meeting me in the order to kill me. He called himself a friend. That backstabbing cheat. How did you learn to read glyphs? And 
These things that you see, how do you do it? Uh, that's none now of your that business. I know where to find Olin, I should be on my way. All by yourself? The Dorito is mine. I'm fast my on my secret. Own. Wait. If that device lets you see the unseen. Out of the way, Erend. I'm asking you to help me, Aloy. Exactly. I need to know who killed exactly. Ursa. Not just the, the Shadow Karja army, I know that. But the exact soldiers who did it. I'm sorry about your sister, but that's your war, not mine. Don't act like this isn't personal. You came here hunting the people who nearly killed you, who massacred your people. Aaron, Why should drunk. you have justice and not me? Uh, because your facial hair is off. I'll head for Red Ridge Pass, where Ursa's body was found, and wait for you there. A few minutes of your focus is all I need. Don't make me beg. Red Ridge Pass, you said. I'll see what I can do. Actually... I can make all these things. Terra Blast Arrow. Actually, can I see what those individual arrows do? Ammo. Oh, those are packs. Oh, I can increase my resources. Always good. Potions, traps, sharpshooters, dripcaster. Health and some more meat. Probably should. I need to sell my unused, unused crap so I can. Afford. Maybe I can buy meat from merchants. So I need to make more potions. I need more potions. They certainly save my bacon. Buy bacon to save bacon. Mm -hmm. Oh, right, I was trying to check about uh, those arrows. Duh. Ammo. Okay, Terror Blast. No damage, but very high tear. Okay, so this this is armor shredding. Harvest arrow. Ooh, interesting. Armor shred, but if it's a part that has resources. So like I believe this is for like the weak points, because I've noticed sometimes when they break off, they become their own pick upable resource. So I think this is like this is what I want to use on those. Okay, so Hunter Arrow, Basic Arrow. We have a Precision for dealing damage. We have Hard Point for shredding. So, good to know on those. Okay, we got, we got a nice balance. We got multiple sources of mucking up our enemies. I like it. Go ahead and fill my pouch of all my cool new arrows. Uh, we want to use normal boot. Certainly don't want to be using my expensive arrows on the first raccoon I run into. As funny as it would be to use like an explosive arrow on a simple little raccoon. Small game box. Can I afford anything else? Game box? Game box? Oh, 
Well, I mean, uh, I, I, I want the meat off of them. I can't really get their meat if I just blow them into little giblets. I've heard of flash frying, but I think that's a little too overkill. <laughs> uh, fast food back in the day. This place smells like nothing I've ever smelled before. Hey Aurora! Welcome on by. Hope you've had a good week. We're closing it out with some Horizon Zero Dawn Friday. I'm lost inside the city, aren't I? Save after all of that shenanigans we got up to. Oh, you're in for a treat. It's quite a show. On the road again. I'm just saying, I uh, hope you've had a good week. We are finishing it out with some Horizon Zero Dawn Friday. Haven't missed much, just got started. Tracking down that merchant who is responsible for our tragic backstory of Dead Father. Why is this red? Oh, it's a rock. What was that? Am I being shelled? Now I can only have 10 rocks. Got one. I mean, if y'all killed it and aren't gonna do anything about about harvesting it, I mean, I'll I'll take it. Free parts is free parts. I do kind of wish harvesting did not interrupt me. Like I could kind of oh, useful. Grab and dash. It is going very well, way weller than I could have even imagined and is kind of scary. Definitely have probably say yeah, I have the the fitty fitty followers. The only thing is the uh, consistent viewers, and that's been hovering pretty close to three. Tough, but I'm used to it. Where's that turkey? 
Where's that turkey? That's well, not a turkey, I think that's a fox. Nope, that's a coon. A raccoon. Oop. Uh. Fire arrow. Woo, baby! Ha! Woo, wee! Don't those explode? Yep, yep, they explode. I find it kind of weird the uh, reptile robot uses cold element. I mean, I guess, in a way, I mean, they're quote unquote cold blooded. Four shots, five shots. Um, hard point. Come on. Oh, I didn't explode the other one. Come on, you creature. Oi! Whoa! Did something just chuck a rock at me? Oh no, another one! Uh... Oh no! Oh jeez! I have angered the gators. Florida will remember this. That's right, group up. Come on. Whoa, hey, buddy. Uh, potion? Use the potion? Use the potion. Alloy? Alloy. I forget how to use potions, I think I did. Yes, there we go. Keep forgetting my medicine pouch is separate from my item usage, even though they're in the same location. Um, oh, that was a bad, bad jump. Oh, wow! Okay. That was a lot of gators, and we exhausted a lot of our stuff. No! Ah, it took a direct hit. How foolish of me. Nope! What the heck is that? Oh, I accidentally put down a trap. Now that's an explosion. All right, that's all of them, I think. So let us harvest. Take all. Ooh, I leveled up. Perfect. I know I needed one more level for something specific. So I will check right after I harvest these gears. Yeah, something about reptiles. Having the cold elemental damage just seems weird to me. But I figured they they want to they'd want to stay warm. More arrows. Need more arrows. Okay. Am I missing anything? Anything? Nope. Although now I have nothing in my medicine pouch. And no health potions. Yeah, yeah, So, you know, last time, last time I had, I kind of, I kind of kludged a bow together. 
and uh, I kind of duct taped it to myself. Now, unfortunately, it got all tangled up with my feathers, with my little little chain from my earpiece to my neck piece. Um, it was absolutely awful to remove. Um, this time, you know, I got a, I got a, I found a better bow, um, and and I attached it with just some better adhesive. Um, much much smoother to remove. Uh, just a little bit of water and it's pro alcohol will just take it right off. Um, much more pleasant, non toxic materials, good stuff. Long leg. Electricity and whatever down arrow is. I kind of want to sneak up and hack it though. I don't think I can hack it. Oh, I think his weakness is just normal, normal physical. Oh man, they're they're robot emus. Oh no. Oh, that's what long legs are. Oh, this is this is awful. I don't know if I want to get close to them. Those things on the back. Armor and electricity. Okay, I can't do armor, or I can't do electricity. But I bet I can do armor shred. You know what? Let's uh, let's try this purple arrow out. I want to see what this does. Oh, that's cool. What are you gonna do, Emu? What are you gonna do? You gonna kick me? You gotta get close to me first. Oh no, it's getting close to me! Ah! What the hell? Oh no, there's three of them. I only pay for two! <laughs> what are you gonna do, stab me? Man who gets stabbed. <laughs> oh, pain and suffering. Pain and suffering. I jumped right into it. Oh, they did the explosion stomp too. Oh, that was so close. All right, I I need to remember the bloody trip caster. No potions, no medicine. Final destination. Yeah, the enemy design is very nice. I also was not expecting such creature variety as well. Oh, those are enemy dudes. I think not sure. Oh. Where's my flesh damage? That one. Oh, that's a painful miss. That one isn't. <laughs> What's on your body, cultist? Three pennies. Alright, not worth it. Health potion, worth. We need those potions.
Okay. So let's see, we're going to an excavation site. They've been going to excavation sites for a while. I feel like what we might find, because we went to a cauldron, that was a side quest, and that expanded the creatures we can hack. So the cauldrons are um, like the nanomachine factories that build the robots. So um, no robo reproduction. I missed that, yes. So I'm wondering if these excavations are where they're finding like the guns that they sometimes have. That was There's close. like a, a weapons manufacturing plant. Or, perhaps, it's where they're getting the uh, corruption stuff. We still do not know what the corruption is, or why, like, they have the corruption, like, is an ally of theirs. Nothing there, idiot! Give me health. I need health. I want to loot the bodies, but I don't want to alert all the robots. I would say my one complaint, and it is so minor and petty, the, uh, the actual manufacturing thing did not do like a, a building animation sort of thing, which is slightly disappointing. It would have been kind of cool if we saw like a machine being assembled part by part, or even just like um, 3D printed style kind of thing. Um, I don't think that would have been too difficult to have done, but you know, what do I know? I'm not, I'm certainly no uh, game, game mancer. Okay, I know y'all are fighting over there. I'm trying to get up here. Yeah, because like it does have, it did have, because I've only been to one of the cauldrons. Like, when I hacked it, it did release like the creature that was in the building area. So like it would have been cool if like it was building that creature or like I did the I did the hack hack QTE and then it does a cutscene where it 3D prints a boss monster I gotta fight. Yeah, that would have been absolutely sick nasty. Why the fuck can I not climb up? What is wrong with you? How do I? Eh. Go this direction, okay? And then... No problem, Aurora. I appreciate you stopping by. I have gotten around to put a alert command. So if that tickles your jollies, feel free to use it. <laughs> Sometimes it's the little things. <laughs> There's just there's bloody walls. I mean, setting off the forge is also pretty pretty topical for this game, considering how much foraging I got to be doing. It's all walls. It's walls all the way around. Okay, so something about that- oh, right. Skill. Uh, that's right. Tinker. So I can swap around my equipment things. Ravager. 
Weakness? Fire. Give it a quick hack first. Either a hack or we will open with a sick, nasty melee strike. I don't think I can hack them yet. Nope, can't hack, but I can do that. Come on, hit the bat. Woo! Hey, laser beams! How about you stop? How about you stop? No, there's another one! Oh, no. I made so many mistakes. That was several mistakes in a consecutive order, all in a row. All right, Zappy Kitties have machine gun QQ. That's um, that's an upgrade. <laughs>